Can I ask why you did separate home runs for two countertop receptacles? That was a question from the original Markle, and that was a question regarding this electrical rough-in for this basement kitchen. I do believe this is a valid question, and there's a lot of debate up for this, and I'm open for it. A lot of this comes down to what region and code the work is being done in, the inspector, and whether or not this is actually defined as a kitchen because there's no stovetop. Let me know in the comments how would you wire this, two separate runs or one. Based on the Canadian electrical code, and this would be regarding 26722D3, this counter space requires two receptacles. And then if you jump back to code 26656, it says at least two branch circuits shall be provided for receptacles installed for kitchen counters of dwelling units accordance to rule 26722D3, 4, and 5. Generally what you do with kitchen counter receptacles, if you check out what I did with this kitchen right here, you have box number one being fed by a circuit and box number two being fed by another circuit. Then on the same branch circuit, you go from one, jump over two and feed number three. Then on the next branch circuit, you go from two, jump over three and feed four. So knowing that, that's how I approach the situation that I did with the two receptacles. I do know the inspector in this area and he will most definitely be checking for two separate circuits for two receptacles. Let me know in the comments what you would do. Thanks for the question and thanks for watching.